In the 20 years she's lived in her Renton neighborhood, Katrina Jones has never seen trash pickup delayed for this long. We haven't had our garbage emptied in over a month. Nobody's calling us. They're not telling us anything. She's now placing these stone slabs on top of the garbage to smash it down. You have to be creative and make more room in the bins that are now filled to the brim. Bins that were scheduled to be emptied on Wednesday after a month of delay due to historic snowfall during the holidays. Then on Wednesday, Republic Services, a company contracted for pickup, issued a work stoppage after workers in Washington paused work to support workers on strike in San Diego forcing residents like Katrina to wait even longer. People are having to take trash elsewhere. People like Latanya Rogers who are now trying to drop off excess trash at transfer stations. These are our cans here. She lives in a household with six people. The garbage is going to pile up. We're coming off of the holidays as well. Rogers has lived in Renton for 24 years and also can't believe what's happening. We've never seen trash being piled up like this and not even getting any correspondence. For now, they're figuring it out on their own. You can't burn it, so it's been piling up. So we've been storing it. The concern is how much longer this will go on. What we worry about is rodents. So Renton is not the only place where this is happening. It's the same story in Kenmore, Bellevue, Kent, and other areas around the sound. Automated calls have been going out from Republic Services, updating customers about this holdup. We have a response from Republic Services tonight to King 5. It says in part, take a look, this is related to a labor issue in California that has nothing to do with any Washington employees. We are taking the steps necessary to minimize service disruptions. Now, the next collection day can be for some people up to a week or perhaps even two weeks, meaning trash may not potentially be picked up for later on this month. For now, we are live in Renton. I'm Christine Pay, King 5 News.